What's up, my XRP brothers from another mother and my cute XRP sisters? This is Rob of the XRP 007 channel coming to you from a beautiful Venice Island. Absolutely gorgeous day down at the beach. Five out of five. Uh, we live for this weather. Absolutely. And the title of this episode is XRP Monopoly. And Ripple just bought Boardwalk Park Place. Owns all the railroads and the utilities. <laughs> Watch this episode to the end. I'm feeling it. Just love watching this 5D, 5D chess game. 5D game of chess they're playing. Uh, and you know what? And it says, yeah, and they're coming for the utilities too. So much fun. And uh, this is going to be the fastest seven and seven minutes. I'm, I'm actually going to have a little fun. So I did want to get an episode in because I love my XRP family. But uh, weather's so pretty. I called my oldest son. He's got the day off. I said, uh, pick you up in 30 minutes. Wear something nice. So we're going to zip it up to the UTC mall area. Find us a nice place for some outdoor dining. And indeed, if you are new to this channel, if you would hit the subscribe button to subscribe the bell for notification that like button tap it slap it whatever you are feeling for taco tuesday and also in the comments great comments as always love them uh, phil the amendment says xrp also uh is his savings along with silver and he also owns very little cash and then edwin says i love this he says i've kissed he says i've kissed the ground a thousand times in prayers to god asking for a settlement you and me both brother this has uh, been such a long grind and also in the comments mary says uh up in ocean city maryland her condo taxes leap from 3100 to 8700 dollars she commented legalized robbery i agree 110 percent absolutely just criminal exactly um let's see by the way let's see where am i i gotta kind of have to kind of get some of my juicy ones i have not in order so i gotta kind of slide these back on where i wanted to go all right so to begin the fastest seven and seven and they are all backwards which is not good for me you can tell so we're just trying to do it from this way la 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 so pause with me this is unprofessional to say the least but hey i don't care it's tuesday right there we go that's kind of the order i wanted so let's begin uh, number one almost <laughs> you gotta love an unprepared episode there it is number one so let's begin number one iso 222 european parliament this one's this one's just really Juicy European Parliament endorses regulations mandating, wait for it, instant payments by March 2024, not 2025, not 2026. Next month, people, March 2024. God, I'm loving that. Absolutely. Number two, uh, this is from Poolside Chad over in Fort Lauderdale. It says Gemini Exchange launches XRP perpetual derivatives contract just another line them up number three sean mcbride over on twitter says ripple acquiring standard custody a wholly owned subsidiary of polysign when i said uh, ripple's kind of like playing the monopoly game and they are going to own every single piece of that monopoly board <laughs> make zero doubt about it in my humble opinion yeah there might be a few that go away so but anyway they're just going to monopolize that monopoly board and this is just one more you see like a you do you see a pattern here with custody and the tokenization of real world, world assets. I think they see a literal gold mine, no pun intended, on that one. Number four, this is the fastest, <laughs> as we go on to the fastest seven and seven. Number four is Medico, indirect uh, link of adoption of Ripple. This is what they go on to say. There's an indirect link of adoption of Ripple and Medico's solutions furthering the adoption of the XRPL, XRP Ledger, 100% true. Number five, this is a uh, rumor still swirling per a crypto lawyer named James Murphy says there is a rumor still swirling about a settlement with the SEC and Ripple. God, that one belongs right there. Hope that we'll be uh, on our knees kissing the ground <laughs> later on this afternoon. Like in two hours, someone, someone, uh, someone, uh, tag me if that happens on the phone will you number six xrp holding 52 cents like a boss not really any ta down by the beach in, uh, at the moment but go watch yesterday yesterday's episode if you haven't seen it it's a good one if you want to talk and see, see some more uh, ta price predictions all that stuff but yeah it's holding 52 cents like a boss in a stable coin for like the last four years 
or six years since 2018 uh, and it's down 1.5 percent and the cpi numbers did come out this morning i haven't checked on those we'll see if that moves the needle number seven this is from emily i uh, saved the best for last this is graham rodford ceo ex uh, of the exchange Arcax, which is located over in london goes on to say that he believes this is so juicy i can just take my time and just walk down to the field on this one he believes that xrp will be processing up to 50 trillion dollars in the next two years 50 trillion dollars in the next two years i'm going to crunch some numbers you guys welcome to chime in what that would do and create a price for xrp maybe we'll get out that xrp calculator that's over on brad kime's site and play with that and see what that gives us for a price of xrp and it says yeah, that's absolutely uh, w w what I'm looking at. And so exactly why my end game that I have for my final touchdown is the end of 2025. Not that I'm selling all my bags then, but that's the point I wanted. I'm waiting to see where the price of XRP is by the end of 2025. And uh, so and uh, he goes on to say, so anyway, so that's like th that my first uh, uh, touchdown is that point. And then my first marker that I have, like I mentioned yesterday's videos from that April to June time frame, for a Fibonacci tag the targets of six to twenty-seven dollars. That is around the corner. Literally, we're about forty days from from that being within our window. Maybe sooner, but that's kind of my window I have for that first kind of take profit, not financial advice advice for me in that six to twenty-seven dollar range. And my second spike the ball is the end of twenty twenty-four. I'm calling it. I'll say it again. That's where I see XRP hitting three digits by the end of this year. Uh, per Catals, every bank in Japan will be using XRP. So call that easy for me, a $100 XRP. They're my three targets that I'm looking to kind of score with my XRP. And also I will be holding a lot of my bag totally for long term. And so, yeah, are we uh, less than 120 days from Valhalla? I think we are, if not sooner. So comment down below. I do want to know what you think. I'm going to say the very best, very best, is actually a comment that was left in the tweets. And it gets me so smiling. I think I'll have you guys smiling, too. It's from David Smith. Uh, he says, a pleasure to listen to your podcast. He says, you're a true gentleman and scholar. Thank you so much. Be still my beating heart. I really appreciate that. He says, uh, he says it's quite simple. We wait. And the waiting is the tough part, and we know that's so true, but we'll do and endure what we have to do. We'll continue to wait. And yes, I have met many people who have capitulated. They've sold their bags. They've moved on to other things. Some of them not by design, that they just had their tokens uh, stolen, which is so unfortunate, you know, that they lost it, whether it's from Celsius dump or anything like that. So anyway, but he says, we wait. We will endure the wait. But then he uh, marks two things that will be the turning point for XRP. One, obviously, is the case settling. The SEC investigation will be completely over. That case, one and done, and we know who wins. It's all just about the bar tab now, which is ridiculous. And then the second thing is for regulations to come in and to be ushered in place. And we're looking at the regulations to be here by the end of June, if not sooner. So that seems to be expedited, working in our fashion as well. And he says, we will literally watch, and listen to this, I love this, literally watch utility embedded itself into the financial system with our xrp and he says he hopes by the end of 2025 that we see an xrp price between wait for it get out your calculator my friends 1900 dollars. that's his starting target and this is in pounds by the way and then up to thirty-eight thousand per xrp coin comment down below i want to know what you guys think Everybody have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.